<laughs> it's a very, it's a complicated <laughs> scenario to I be in. I think a lot of women want to be in that spot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's why I think <laughs> I have their blood Would you play the lead there? <laughs> but I don't understand. People, people don't get it. It's like you die. You die after it. Like, no one seems but to put two and two together. Oh, no, you die, but don't you come back as an, a vampire? Well, it depends. I mean, that's the whole story that he thinks because he's afraid of turning into a vampire because he's uh, so intoxicated by her blood that... Um, he just thinks, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to drink it all, and then, and then you're done. Was it so. easy for you to embrace this character? Uh, it wasn't easy, but um, I definitely found... Was it difficult? Yeah, it was quite, it was quite hard, but I mean, it's, when you're looking at a character description, I mean, literally, I bet you're on the book, it says something about him being the perfect person. Uh, <laughs> I know it doesn't really. I mean, but it, it says but it like, should. But yeah, in, in the character breakdown when I was doing the audition, it said Edward is the perfect being in every way, and like even going for the audition, it's kind of embarrassing. You're just well, like, you possibly could. Not only are you this talented actor, you also sing. You play uh, instruments. I heard you play the piano, the guitar. You actually have a song mm. on the soundtrack. Mm -hmm. So uh, tell us about uh, your musical background. Um, I used to want to be a musician before before I kind of fell into acting. My sister is a songwriter as well. And um, <clears throat> I wanted to be a pianist in restaurants. I just always thought that was doing the kind of Tom Waits thing was like my, <laughs> my ideal. Love Tom Waits. <laughs> <laughs> um, but I guess since the advent of like Kazar and all these like download things, it's impo physically impossible to make any money out of music whatsoever. Yeah. Um, so, you know, I kind of, I, I've never really pursued it as a career. Still a passion of yours, though, oh, obviously. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I mean, it, it is always kind of embarrassing, though, when, you're, when actors are playing music. And it's very frustrating, because <laughs> I don't know why it's such, such a stigma attached to it. Yeah. There is? I didn't know. I, I really? thought it would just make you more multi-talented, you know? I don't know. You either come off as like being like a kind of franchise person who's gonna, then going to release a fragrance and a clothing line <laughs> and all this other stuff. <laughs> Isn't that what well, you have planned next? <laughs> oh yeah, it's actually I have my, <laughs> I have my I have my naked calendar coming out as well. <laughs> All the girls are giddy. Yes. Okay, don't lead them on. Don't lead them on. So it's because so you did the Harry Potter. Now you're doing Twilight. You seem to do these movies based on the super uber popular novels, kind of like the fantasy films too. Is there is that the genre you like, or is that just what you've fallen into? Just completely fallen into it. I mean, I was doing. Tiny, tiny thing. After Harry Potter, I really went to try and do because I never went to drama school or anything. I, I wanted to teach myself how to act with no one really judging me on it. <laughs> so I did tiny, tiny movies um, and TV shows in Europe, and um, this kind of came about by accident. I still, I didn't even realize quite how big it was when I did it and when I got the part. And it wasn't as big as it is now. I and mean, it just. It's got, it gets bigger and bigger every oh, week, yeah. Yeah. and now it's everywhere. I mean, absolutely everywhere. <laughs> Anybody you would love to work with? Um, um, really, sure. I'd like, to I'd like to work with Terrence Malick, maybe. Um, I don't know. Tons and tons of people. Well, I, right now, I think it's people who want to work with Robert who are yeah, lighting up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so you're traveling a lot now. There's, you don't even have a home base, it seems like. Tour after tour after tour, right? Recently, yeah. I've been okay. kind of... I mean, I've been living in a monthly lease apartment <laughs> like with a, with a pay-as-you-go phone for <laughs> almost the whole year. Well, we're, thank you for stopping by the so San Francisco. Yeah, San Francisco. By the way, Twilight opens Friday, November 21st. Can't miss it. It's a great movie. Thanks, Robert.